with Mr. Ed Neal, hitchhiker of Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Ed, 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 Ed. Ed, Ed, Ed. What up? How you doing, buddy? Cannibal Cam here. We're having more fun than drunk monkeys with new shoes. And then, and well, actually, you got started last night too. So uh, yes, we did. We have stopped actually. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> what day? I'm supposed to be in Pittsburgh. What is uh, Tuesday, right? No, uh, Thursday actually. Thursday, Thursday. Yeah, well, yeah. Th no, Thursday. But I was gonna be in Akron. <laughs> oh, fantastic! So how are we doing this weekend so far? Oh man, we're having way too much fun. But we made bail. Made bail. Oh, it's <laughs> all good. It's all good. <laughs> Twice. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! My agent said, "Do not call here for any more bail money." Wow. How does, Mark, he Mark. how does he keep a hold of you? Uh, well, well, he, he doesn't. He, no. He, he, that's why he sends me out of town. He goes, how far am I going out of town? As far as I can get you. Oh. <laughs> so you got here yesterday already to a huge reception. and uh, Man, we've met so many nice people up here. We just, man, if we knew it was this much fun, we'd have been here sooner. <laughs> and this isn't your first time. No, no. We were here five years ago. But this, this is this crazy film. What happens is every year, there's a whole new set of people that haven't seen the movie before because they weren't quite old enough or they just hadn't gotten around to it and their friends now made them watch it. So every year or every couple of years, we have like an entire new generation that's never seen the film before. So it's a lot of fun. Yeah, it's kind of nice to see the younger generations approaching just obviously they were born 10 years ago kind of right. thing. And well, what happens is it's really funny. We, we, we have these parents who come in and they tell us, well, I took Jimmy to see it last week because he was 12, and I've never let him watch it before. And we've heard every single age, every single age there is. Like, you know, I didn't let my kids watch it till 19. And then the scary ones, the scary ones. <laughs> I didn't let my kids watch that till they were at least five. <laughs> <laughs> That's That'd something to shock you. Jimmy into that was the one, that was little Jimmy, the one that was caught uh, skinning the cats. Yeah, that yeah, kid. Yeah. You know? <laughs> First scene, they see him freaking, you know. <laughs> <laughs> shaving his arm and shaving Franklin's arm. No, it's good. Julie was at least five. I was like, oh, no. I have like eight kids, so I'm going, Ooh, scary. Now that's scary. <laughs> so obviously you're still having fun playing uh, playing Mr. Hitchhiker and coming out to these conventions and hanging out with everybody. Oh, yeah, and we, we do a lot of dubbing. We dub a lot of Japanese anime. I got four voices in the new Lord of the Rings game, and we got the biggest selling Wii game right now, uh, Metroid Prime 3. I do five voices in that. And uh, we dub a lot of Jap anime. Is uh, I do a hundred. I do twenty-seven voices in Gatchaman, one hundred and six episodes. So wow. they pay me to talk stupid, and I'm not even in politics. Oh geez, <laughs> <laughs> life is good. <laughs> oh natural. I said, I said, let me get this straight, just so we be real clear here. You gonna pay me money to talk stupid? <laughs> Where do I sign? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and how stupid do you need? I can go get some more. <laughs> I got plenty of stupid. <laughs> Just open up that bottle and we're good. You're going to be paying for it. I'll go get some more. <laughs> oh, Lord. I work late. <laughs> Double shift. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> so we're obviously having a good time. We got fans coming up all the time. God, we got, we, man, this, this is so cool to do stuff like this. People come from like Florida and strange places like Michigan, you know. I'm from Niagara Falls, Ontario. Oh, I was, I played Niagara Falls. I'm very big in Niagara Falls. I was a guy in the, that rubber thing goes over, you know. Oh, you, yeah, yeah, a yeah. few times. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the water's almost out. <laughs> so, uh, so what's in store in the future for uh, Mr. Neal? Oh, man, we got some fun stuff coming out. Uh, uh, we're going to do a Dante Tomaselli film called The Ocean. We're going down to uh, yeah, 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 oh, yeah. Man, he's been talking. He's been promoting that he's for a while. Saving the money and just about to shoot. We're just about to start, and he's uh, Isn't Judith O'Day in there also. Yeah, we're gonna go down to Puerto Rico and film. We're going to do so. We're going to have so much fun. We're going to get caught, but no, we're going down there. And then uh, Herschel Gordon Lewis oh. is 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 doing a uh, rewrite on a script right now called Blood de Madame, and we're gonna do that. And I said, I, and I again said. Wait a minute, hold on, hold on. You're going to give me money to work with Herschel Gordon Lewis? <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> they were going, they'd never met any Baptists before <laughs> from the deep south. <laughs> They're all like Catholic guys going, what? <laughs> Go, guys. Because <laughs> I thought, you know, being paid money to hang out with Herschel. Icons you know, and oh stuff. Oh, my God. I was like, let me at that. Honestly, <laughs> we, you wouldn't even have to pay you. We're going to tear that script up. <laughs> Ain't gonna be nothing left but shredded paper on the floor, baby. So what's this H.G. Lewis film about, or can you say uh, anything? Uh, well, I'm, uh, 
I don't even know. Uh, he's rewriting it right now, but it, it, it appears I'm going to play, I know you'll be shocked, <laughs> some weird demented guy. Oh, get out of here. I know. My Bullshit. Age is, my age is it. You're perfect. <laughs> you, Gee, thanks. I said, uh, okay. How come I don't get Tom Cruise parts? He goes, because Tom Cruise gets them. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. See how logical. That's see, logical. How, see how it works? <laughs> Duh. Fantastic. Well, we're hanging out here with Mr. Ed Neal at the Cinema Wasteland here in uh, April, I assume it is. April. And <laughs> April. I'm supposed to be in Akron. <laughs> that was last week. Last week. Oops. Missed it. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder they've been calling all day. Where are you? Oh. <laughs> Akron. Last week. All right. So we'll be checking in with Ned Ed throughout the rest of the weekend. And right. uh, so stay tuned here on Cinema Wasteland. There you go. Thanks, man. Awesome, thank you very much. <laughs>